Good morning, beautiful people, and welcome to the 2Gen Beauty and Lifestyle channel. I am recording an unboxing video for my September Petit Vor box. <clears throat> and this is my second box with Petit Vor. I received the um, August box probably about a week and a half ago because I signed up at the very, very end of August. And then this is my September box. And the box is different. The first box was a little bit larger and it was pink, like a, like a, maybe like a pa more pastel pink. This one is like a hot pink, still has the Petit Vore name on the side and the also lovely Petit Vore logo um, on the end, be bold and be kind. And so this particular box was co-curated with uh, Tashina Combs from Logical Harmony. So I have seen a couple of sneak peeks and I believe this is her second uh, box that she's co-curated with them. So I'm just going to go ahead and dive right in. So this themes box is Beauty in the Box. And you can see right there it says Petit Vor and Logical Harmony. And let's see. And on the back, it just gives us an idea of what is in the box. And then there's another card in here, but I'm gonna, I'm assuming it goes with one of the products, so I'll pull that out when that happens. So the first thing I'm gonna go ahead and pull right out so that I can actually apply it because I have nothing on my lips is the Alovi Tinted Lip Butter. We believe you should feed your lips the most pure ingredients on the planet. And this is cool because it's like a different shape than a regular lip balm. It's kind of oblong, like an oval. Let's see what it looks like. Um, so I guess maybe slightly tinted. Let me. So I just swatched it on my hand. Yeah, you could catch that little bit of color right there. Not a whole lot of tint to it, but that's cool. I mean, I can always use a lip butter. It smells really good. I usually put on lip butter before bed so that my hair, um, not in my hair, my lips stay moist during um, bedtime. And then I always wear like rose hip oil on my face because the air conditioning and the fan, I feel like everything gets dry and even my hair gets dried out. So anything that I can kind of put in to stay a little bit more moisturized is always good. So this will definitely come in handy. And let me see the back. So this is a full size product and this is $5. And it's really just six ingredients, which is amazing. And the tint itself is made with the red root of a Mediterranean flower called Alkanet. Pretty cool. Let me see if the ingredients are listed on here. All right, so just six ingredients. Macadamia nut oil, coconut oil, sunflower oil, marula oil, shea butter, and the Alkanet root extract for the tint. So very cool. Made with love in California. Certified vegan and obviously cruelty free. So liking this. Second thing in here is the Root Science Face Scrub. And it still has kind of like, actually a very shiny bottle. Okay, so this is, it's a powder. Very similar, I guess, to the mask and the face wash that I got in the August box. So that's cool. I mean, I like face products, especially natural ones really into the rosehip oil like i just said so this is a pretty large sample it's 1.5 ounces and this also goes with the card root science skincare redefined the routine so we got this card in there as well and on the back it just gives you information on a morning routine and an evening routine and then also a weekly routine different things that you should do with the product and then I guess there's also something called the beauty bar so I'm gonna have to check that out yeah that's pretty cool they kind of give you all the instructions and let's see the root science skin care full sizes run 49 to 59 
but it doesn't really say what the full size is. But let me tell you, this is a pretty large sample size. Like, and it's, I'll tell you, it's filled probably up to about here on the bottom. So that is not too bad whatsoever. So I'm excited to try this. Next thing in here, let's see, is the Feed Your Ends Leave-In Conditioner from Yarok. Oops, sorry, wrong way. Yarok. Heat protection, pure, all natural, 100% vegan, free of gluten, alcohol, parabens, sulfates, and cruelty. So this is very cool. And again, this is a huge sample. This is two ounces. And the full size goes for $13.20. I'm not sure if this is a full size. It, it very well could be. Um, but I'll definitely put that information in the description box. So this is pretty cool. Protect your ends with this nutritious leave-in conditioner spray packed with vitamins, minerals, and essential oils that nourish hair prior to blow drying or heat styling. Well, so prior to, I actually just dyed my hair yesterday, um, and you'll see a video on that, but I just ironed it this morning, so I'm just going to spray and see what it, ooh, it smells really good. Yeah. It smells very, um, is it eucalyptus? I'm not sure what it is. Let me look at the ingredients. It smells really, really good. Kind of citrusy, it has jojoba, grapeseed oil, olive oil, apricot oil, primrose oil. Oh, it's got rosemary, that's what it is. It's the rosemary. It smells really, really good. So excited to try this. Um, you know who steals my leave-in conditioner? My son. I don't know if you've seen my son. He's got hair probably to about here. He's always taking my leave-in conditioner, so I have to hide them. And this is the last product in the bag, in the box, is the LVX nail polish. And I saw some un unboxings for the September box already, and some people got the Mineral um, Lily Lolo eyeshadow, <clears throat> the Mineral pigment, and I think that the LVX was actually in the first box that Logical Harmony um, co-curated with Petit Vore. So that's cool. I would have been happy with either one. I have tons of like mineral pigment eyeshadows. I was kind of excited to try Lily Lolo, um, but I'm also excited to try LVX because I've never used a nail polish from them. And this is in a kind of like a cotton candy pink, I would say, and it's called Lolly. I don't know if you can actually see the color really well. Oh, and it kind of comes off and it has like a another thing on there. And I'm going to swatch this really quickly on my thumb for you guys. It's really pretty. This would have been a good, um, like a spring color or a summer color. More spring, I would say. So here is... Oh, too much glare for you guys. Let's see if I can stop the glare somehow. So that's one coat. You can't really tell it's even pink in the, in the video. And let me try and get another coat on there. It actually goes on pretty smooth. It's not very streaky. It's very nice. It's a very nice color. See if we can get that. Yeah, you can't even really tell it's pink. But it's cute. It's a it's a pretty like cotton candy pastel Easter color pink. So I'll definitely be giving this a shot, and I know my daughter will also try to steal it and use it, and that's fine. We share all of our nail polish. Um, so that is everything in my box. Um, I love everything that I've received from uh, Petit Vor so far, um, except for I haven't really used yet is the BWC eyeliner pencil in the brown because <clears throat> I don't use eyeliner pencils very often. So 
I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Um, if you enjoy my videos, uh, please subscribe. Uh, I appreciate all the comments and all the subscribers. And I will definitely be putting information in the description box on where you can get these products and a link to Petit Vore. Um, I hope you enjoyed it and have a great day.